one and I'm gonna be checking out Jungle Cruise, the trailer. So let's go ahead and start this. Uh oh, little add on it. So we have a what eighteen hundred, seventeen hundreds setting. Troublesome British lady at and the rock. <laughs> okay. The Rock's playing on the scam artist, I guess. I feel like this trailer is like one of those trailers that kind of tells the movie. I mean, but The Rock is in it, so most people are going to watch it anyway. All right, Jungle Cruise. Hello, it's Audrey. Uh, welcome to the Variety Show. Today I'm going to be reviewing the movie called Jungle Cruise. Jungle Cruise stars Emily Blunt and Dwayne LaRock Johnson. Um, Emily Blunt plays Lily, this um, researcher botanist on the quest to find a miracle plant that can cure any disease. Uh, in the Amazon. So she needs, you guessed it, Dwayne The Rock Johnson to give her a cruise to <laughs> find this miracle plant in the Amazon jungle. Um, as always, the scale for these movies is a little unorthodox. I have skip it, wait for streaming, matinee price, or go out and see it. And with that being said, um, the movie was good. Uh, there were a couple of placing issues. Uh, the villain was, there were two villains in this movie and they were just your generic villains. Uh, nothing to write home uh, home about. The more prominent villain uh, was uh, a German a German man looking to find this miracle plant in the Amazon to have world domination. <laughs> so I mean, it's already you know a silly premise, but uh, everything works. Everything makes sense um, for the most part. I mean, as much as you know your book. Suspension of disbelief is 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 fine. You're not taken out of the movie at, at any point. Um, Emily Blunt's character, um, the female botanist, she's very headstrong, very gung ho, and she stays that way through the entire movie. Um, very fearless, very brave, and knows what she wants. Uh, she pretty much stays that way through the entire movie. They only really give her like one weakness to overcome and that has really has nothing to do with her her character development not really 
Um, as far as the Wayne the Rock, the Wayne or the Rock goes, um, him either. I mean, these characters pretty much stay the same throughout the movie. There wasn't really any any character development for any of the characters at all. There was also a brother character to uh, Emily Blunt's character named McGregor. And um, surprisingly, he's given a little bit to do. Uh, it's, it's just um, characters that reacting to the situations. There wasn't any, you know, overall arching theme. There's a little bit of a romance element to the movie. But um, other than that, um, The Rock, Emily, and the brother character uh, go on this jungle cruise to find this mystical plant and shenanigans ensue and mystery and danger ensue uh, in the quest to find this this plant. Uh, there was a little bit of um, not plot twist or anything like that, but a nice surprise with one of the characters in the movie. Um, I'm not going to spoil anything. I don't do spoilers or anything like that. But uh, there's something happening throughout all of the throughout the movie, so everyone will be entertained. Um, Dwayne has a lot of dad jokes, which were pretty cute, uh, and it was overall a a good movie. So I'm going to say go out and see it as a uh, as a rating for this movie. Now I would not do a, the streaming service. Uh, I wouldn't pay $30 on Disney Plus to see it, but you know, that's your business. But uh, it is worth the watch. And that's all I have for this one. Thank you and bye-bye.